go, here we go. 70, Indy. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. Get it ready. This is Kenyon Drake, the fourth-year man from Alabama. And they'll get eight out of this before being stopped at the 28. Well, I think that's what they're going to need to do here in the first half. You've got to take some pressure off of this young quarterback, and no better way to do it than to establish the running game early. Second and two. And on the left side here, Wilson. And he'll be brought down right around the 37. Wilson now in his second season in Miami. First four years were in Kansas City. He's always been a solid complimentary receiver, but Miami really hoping he can take the next step in his development, be more of a go-to guy now at 27 years of age. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. They'll run the drive, and that play went nowhere. Losing yardage, it'll be back at the 36. That's going to go as a loss of one on first down. second down it's Drake and he puts his head down and gets up to the 42 for a gain of about six despite the blitz they're still able to pick up a nice solid gain the disadvantage of blitzing often alters the normal spacing and run fits and leaves creases like they were able to exploit right there to throw. Yeah, that one's going to be knocked away and incomplete. Down. 60 Pittsburgh. Check, check. Watch it be full. Watch it be full. You're trapped. You're trapped. Five. They'll start the drive with Drake. Go, go, go. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. Officially no gain on the play, and it's second down. So nothing there that time, and maybe you need to look to the O-line. They weren't able to create any space. No, they weren't, and you know as well as I do, as many offensive line coaches we've ever met, I think that'll be addressed loudly when those guys get to the sideline. And they're usually loud and big. <laughs> and brought down, but not before reaching the 25. Give him 14 on that one and a first down. I think it all came together there. In breaking route, drove it with excellent pace. Money throw right there to move the sticks. He finds an opening past the 40. Throwing the out route incomplete. That's Wilson. Another strong gain on the last two plays. They've moved it a combined 33 yards. But that's what you're looking for when you're wanting to throw the ball downfield. You want one of those guys who can play out on the perimeter, can play out wide, who can not only get open, but when they're covered, can uncover themselves downfield and create catches. Here we go. Set. 18 Gator. Let's go, defense. Let's get out the field, defense. Two. On first down, he'll drop to throw. Now that'll be tipped and intercepted. Picked off by the free safety, Eric Berry. And he'll get this one out to the fifth. start the drive on the ground and he's upended after a gain of two out to the 27. you mentioned very early on the need to establish a running game for this young qb they really haven't been able to do that though in the first half so that means what in halftime adjustments Adjustment. time, right figure out what they are figure out the things that they really want to accomplish and who to run behind which are your better blockers find those guys and get in that direction and that's the big fella's M.O. right there. Running through tackles, keeping the sticks moving forward. And this defense, if you don't bring 11 guys to the ball to try and get him on the ground, he's going to keep making runs like that. I feel the press box shaking every time he touches the rock. Running, it's Drake. And the running lane's non-existent in this first half as they'll stop him behind the line. It's a loss of a yard there, and now second down. Second down, it's Drake. 
And hard running's going to get him over the 40 to the 42. Seven yards on the carry, make it third and four coming up. But you've got to give kudos to your offensive line and the guy carrying the ball because they were in a second and long situation. It seemed pretty dire, but they brought it back to third and manageable with that run. Here we go, here we go. 90 Wolf. Let's go, defense. defense. They'll set up a throw. Throwing right, and that's complete. And this is going to lead to another first down as the tackle's made at the box 33. They brought in a heavy set on third down, and that usually means running play, but we have seen them throw out of that formation. And sure enough, they snuck the tight end out on that one, wound up hitting him for a first down. This offense finding its legs now. Here's another first and 10. Now Drake. And he'll get it down inside the 30 to the 29-yard line. Give him five on the carry there, and it'll be second down. Now Balazs shrugs him off, and he'll be brought down. Oh, that's a face mask. Certainly looked like it indeed. Here come the flags. Defense. So that flag will cost him 15. And it doesn't matter anymore how you get the face mask. Any part of it, that's going to be 15 yards. And now it's first and 10. A big mistake, especially when you factor in the personal foul yardage. Now a handoff for Drake. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. That's going to go as a loss of two, and it'll be second down. Oh, that's a tough one right there. He ran right into the teeth of the blitz as the linebacker was freed up in order to stuff that one for a loss. I think quarterbacks got to see that. Got to find a way to audible into something a little more advantageous. Coming up at the half, a reminder, we go back to Orlando to check in with Jonathan Coachman. He'll have a look back at our first half, as well as a look ahead to what's coming up later this weekend. Back to throw now on second and ten. The Red Sea parts, and there he goes. The 20, 10, and it's a pick six. He brings it back to the house for a Buccaneer TD. Short throw pick six right there, those linebackers. They love when those short throws come and those eyes get... and be backed up to the 24. Now the Dolphins going to burn the first of their timeouts as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. A loss of a yard there to start out. That leads to a second and 11. On play action, they'll throw. And that one got tipped, kind of threw everything off. It brings up third. And as a first-rounder, a lot of eyes on him, a lot of expectations. And he has to play well in his rookie year. Those days of coddling guys and bringing him along slowly, those days are long gone. When you're drafted in the first round, they expect you to play right away. In the community's eyes and fan base, they'll be on you the entire way. They added a lot of talent to a roster that really needed an infusion of youth. They got And for the third time here in this half, it's intercepted. Picked up by Levante David. And it's a pick six. He brings it back to the house for Buccaneer TD. Partner, what we just saw, that's a great example of a team that was really amped up. They've been playing so well, yet they didn't get over it. Drake, and he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. 
That sends him two yards in the wrong direction and leads to second down. The Dolphins going to take their second timeout as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. Well, we just saw a great example of what we talked about with his coach prior to the game. He's definitely one of the better linebackers at reading a play and flowing to make the stop before it turns into something big. So after the loss of two, here's second and 12 from the 23. Here we go on second and 12. They'll tussle for it, and this is going to be caught. Pass interference, defense. Trying to defend the out route there, got the P.I. call. And you know what's difficult about that one is sometimes you want to make the undercut move and go for the football, and other times just want to hang on the upfield shoulder and make the tackle. I think he got caught in between and created a foul. And throwing to start the drive, but that one incomplete. Devontae Parker, the intended receiver, but it's going to be second down. Here now is second and 10, again for the 41. Second and 10. He's going to let one go deep for Parker. And he bats it away, and it falls down incomplete. Devontae Parker was the intended receiver. And that takes us from second to third down. As we thought they might do here in week two of the preseason, they'd left their starting quarterback out there for the second quarter, but I would imagine we will not see him after halftime. Yeah, this is the time of year you've got to get your back up some reps and make sure you protect your starting quarterback. So back-to-back -back incompletions, and that has him staring at a third and ten. They're able to locate Wilson. And this is going to lead to another first down as the tackle's made at the Bucs' 34-yard line. Now the Dolphins will use the last of their timeouts as the stoppage will come with a little under a minute to go in this first half. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. Under a heavy rush and down he goes. William Goldston able to run him down for a loss of 12 that time. They're going to need to get up and set in a hurry. Back to throw. Three scores down, not even a halftime yet. They're not getting much generated offensively. They've got to figure it out. It's tough because this, this defense just seems to be playing with so much confidence right now. They really are. They are on their toes, and they're getting at them. The Dolphins on third down. They've hit two for four thus far. This will be third and forever. Now back to throw. Wilson snags it left side. But Charles, we saw a comeback bid fall just a little short, but give them credit, they were able to hold on, withstand that comeback, and ultimately win it by the slim margin. And bottom line, when it's all said and done, they don't ask you how much you won by. They just want to know, did you win? And that they did. So that'll do it for my partner, Charles Davis, and the best darn crew in the industry. I'm Brandon Gaunt. This has been a presentation of the NFL on EA Sports. The Bucks are winners here as we say so long from Tampa.